Good morning, everyone. Well, I am very excited to report that my garden is off and running. I found a great person to help bring my vision to life, and I wanted to share that with you, so take a look. Right, we don't have nearly enough. We need a lot more. Thank <laughs> you. 
A lot of worms? A yeah. Lot of worms. worms love wood chips. That's the idea. Give them worms and cardboard and they're pretty happy. Where's the worms? They're everywhere. They're everywhere? Not every scoop I get. Well, now I say that. <laughs> they, they disappear as soon as you <laughs> uncover them. Very quickly they disappear. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there's a couple. Oh, there's see them all now? One, oh two, yeah. Three, yeah, there's there a bunch of them. Here, here. Yeah, everywhere. That's awesome. We want them over there. <laughs> oh, guys. All right, that's Spiders are going everywhere. That's good. Yeah. Pull a little forward, actually. Pull a little forward. That way we get more of that. Yeah, okay. Good. Patchwork. Good. Isn't that just a worm? No, look at his eyes. His eyes? Yeah, see his feet. Oh my goodness. His eyes. See him? I do see his eyes. I've never seen anything quite like it. He's it got a like stick on his forehead. Kind of, oh. Oh, oh, I see his legs now. Yeah, I see his little tiny legs. Oh. Oh. Cutie. <laughs> what are we going to do with it? Mm -hmm. I see his legs. Oh. Bugs. Oh, there he goes. He's going to go all the way up in there. It went under there. And then he come out. Oh, I see, I see, uh, yeah. I see part of it moving right there. Okay. I don't know where he's going to go. I just don't want to squish him. I know. I'll, I'll make, I'll be mindful of where he's at. Okay. Because this is all coming down to where he's at. You know, salamanders have been so maligned. They're practically extinct. Yeah. He's so cute. He is. You don't know what's going on. Yeah. I've never seen people before. This is your close-up, baby. <laughs> <laughs> the out. tail just looked like a worm. Yeah. It's the same color. I thought it was when I first seen him. I was like, dang, that worm is moving fast. <laughs> okay, so that's the bottom there. Okay. And then... All this stuff is going to go down now, see? 
Do you think that's low enough? Because we got eight inches on top of that. Well, we're not, I mean, I, if we want to go lower, I got to dig it out, but that's fine. I can go lower. It, that's originally where it was, but I can, we can definitely go. Right. Okay. We can go lower. Um, I mean, it's going to be so much easier to work on if they're higher. But then we got, everything's got to come up. Well. Yeah, I might have to take that down lower. Wow, that's high. But that's not even as high as it's supposed to be? Yeah, it's pretty dang close now. Oh, okay. Well, it's going to be awesome. I mean, you think you can put your dirt, you know, right here. Yeah. I mean, that's... I mean, when you think about it, it's actually the, the, not that high, really. Yeah. No. You're right. And we may level those... Uh, if anything, that's low. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Unless you're wanting to be on your knees. Well, I will even be. if you're on your knees right here, it's still. Yeah, you're right. You're I right. think it looks high because of everything else around it. Yeah. Once everything else comes up, I think it'll look. I think well, it'll look do you think the sun, though, is going to hit hit over here? How much higher is this going to come up? This one? Uh huh. This one's gonna come up. I'm gonna drop this corner down. Yeah. Some. Mm hmm. But it's only gonna come up about this high. And then your eight. So it's lower than this. Plus, I'm cutting two feet off. Oh, right. That way. Yeah, because you want the room in here, remember? Oh, that'll be okay then. Because it'll start... It'll start out here. And if you want, if you only want to do 18 inches, I could do 18 inches too, but that'll offset what you got going on here. Because these are two foot. Yeah, I know. But it'll start right here, you know? Yeah. Be tons of room for the wheelbarrow and stuff to come through here. Mm -hmm. Adding another one. If there's some way we can kind of level this to, like maybe it. Oh yeah. Yeah. Good time. Try and visualize the the final product, and we'll make it happen. Well, look, the, look where the sun is right now. The sun is right there. It's still coming at a real sharp angle, and you know you're getting sun. You're getting sun all through here. So it should be okay to be that high. And that's... It doesn't look that great. I mean, we'll have to build that up somehow, right? Well, I can lower that corner. I think you should. You know? Yeah. I can lower it down about four inches. I think you should. Yeah, I think you should. Uh, let me work on that. Yeah. And then I'll pick your brain when I get it kind of where I think you might want it. That sounds great. Everything is going to be terraced we down. These level. I mean, if you want me to drop them... No, 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 because this is only going to come up eight inches. If you took this down four inches, that's enough. Yeah, I did. You could see it. Because this was about two inches above the... <laughs> you hear that? What was that? That's a turkey. That's a, that's a turkey? Yeah. I've been trying to see him, but he's, sta he's staying right in here. I'm oh, looking my. for a hen. Because the... It's a big tom. It's a yeah. big turkey. Wow, I would love to see him. Yeah. Well, if you see him, well, you they move pretty fast, don't they? He's been he's been staying right here all morning. He's waiting for a hen or something to come in. Well, it's too bad Michael isn't here. The other man that's worked here hunts turkey all April. Yes, that's my plan. Oh, it is? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I won't, I won't hunt your turkeys. No, no, I, I just mean, no, you can hunt my turkey. Oh, okay. No, I just mean... Uh, get this done first. As long as I can eat some of it. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh. Get this done first. Hey, that's a deal. <laughs> it was up here about, you know, another two inches above this. Okay. I dropped it all the way, about four inches. This front corner. Yeah, yeah. so they're all going to be level. That's going to be awesome. It'll, it'll look good when it's all... 
But how do we lift those strawberries up? I don't know that we can. Hmm. That's the only other thing. What are you going to prop up the back corner with? Rock? Yeah, I can use rock. And then a lot of this dirt. Yeah. A lot of this is, you know, some of it's going to go back in, but I'm going to be able to scrape a lot. You think they're bad? I don't know. I don't think so. They only eat bugs. I don't think they eat plants. Well, I was looking online and they're rare. I mean, I don't know if this particular one is rare, but there are many rare salamanders. But this looks like the other one. It looks well, like the other one was pretty dark. This one's got orange on it. Oh. Like a bronze. See it? Yeah. But they move fast, don't they? Mm -hmm. Good grief. These are just little. Can't even keep up with it. I have a feeling they're decomposers. I don't know if they break down plant matter. I don't think they do. They're a bug eater. Maybe they're eating pests. Wouldn't that be good? We can put it in a container and let me look it up. Right now I'm just trying to line these up to where they're they're in line. So okay. Right here, Great. It's good to hear that corner is lined up with this corner. Uh-huh. That and that one box is good. Mm-hmm. But see how the gap I have on this corner right there? Yeah, I see I it. Just gotta push it up just a little bit more. Right. That one's got a gap on it right there on that box, see it? Yeah, but it's only like it's a half an inch. In. That's why. Yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah. That, that, the end of that board just has a pretty, That's okay. Pretty, pretty yeah, a half an inch is not going to throw off the look of the you garden. You never even notice it. And I'm going to push this over just a little bit more. And then I'm going to dig down. And Okay. Sounds great. I'm letting my seedlings get a little air as they're getting a little bit of mildew on the top of the soil. And also air gives them stronger stems when they don't get any airflow, they have weaker stems. But this is news to me. I've never seen this before. I've got all these little things coming up. Wow, it's already drying out. That's funny. See these little... I don't know if that's... What is that? Huh. Just a little... Maybe it's a fungus growing up. seen anything like it. But in general they're looking good. These are celery and they have to be thinned obviously. What's this? This is the smallest thing. Rocket. No, that can't be right. Does not look like rocket. I don't think that's going to make it. Huh. Okay. Those are the seedlings as of today.
goodness. That smells so good. Oh, that Tennessee red cedar smells so fantastic. Mmm. I hope the bugs just run when they smell that. Run. Put a sealer on it to put it in the garden. If you want it to stay looking like this, you know. But now it still takes a lot to get being outside. See what that's done. Yeah, well it. Pine. No, this is cedar. He got it down at your mill, but. I'm talking about that right there. Oh, down there. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think it's treated. Pine. Yeah. But this is this is cedar. But I think all he did was put a just some kind of finish on it. What'll happen to it if I put no finish on it? Now what now? How long will that last if I put no finish on it in the garden, you think? It'll change pretty quick. But I mean, uh, uh. just uh, hold up, I mean, without rotting or... Uh, about rotting? Uh -huh. You don't have to worry about it rotting. I don't have to worry about it rotting? No. Okay, good. Not the cedar. Okay, good. The, the white on this will rot off. Oh, it will? But the, the red will last for all and on and on. Oh, my. Like you tell your guy whenever he's building these, yeah. put the reddest end of the ground. Okay. Yeah. I don't think the, the cedar's going on the ground. Yeah. I think it's just going on top of what's already over here, the treated. Yeah. This is, this is so much better than then uh, you're treated. There's no comparison. Oh, this is this has got a natural oil in it. The cedar does, and that's the reason why it lasts so good. Wow. Maybe I should have had him replace the bottom layer. Yeah, and see, this is organic. Right. It's all natural. But you don't even have two by twelves, do you? What's that? Two by twelves. You don't have two by twelves, do you? Yeah. Oh, you do. Yeah, we got two to twelve. It's not shy, it's just protecting itself. <laughs> Can't see as much of his body now, but it's it's copper colored and brown spots. It's a pumpkin. Pumpkin color. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> I wonder if it, it would let you hold it, wouldn't it? Uh, um, yeah. I don't think they're. Pretty much no, they're not. I looked online and I saw them holding them. Oh wow, look how beautiful! He's cool. It's going, where am I? Mm -hmm. This doesn't look right. Doesn't smell right. Clear. What should we call him? Let's call him uh, Red. Red? 
like a red skeleton with the red hair. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So you're on number five. Yeah. Wow. This one will be done here shortly. This is all fungal activity down here. Is that good? Mm hmm. See, yeah, that's all that's left. Yeah. Is it the air or something that? No, it's just uh, it's just the way they work. It's the flower. It's growing down. Comes up in the morning and then it comes out of really wet. Is it rained last night? Well, they, do they come back or they're just gone? No, those those are done. Might ha you might have other ones right there. Major weeds down here. Dandelion. It's, it's actually very good for you, but I, I haven't really eaten it that much. What is it? Dandelion. Oh. Actually, I'm not sure that's dandelion. I don't think so. Wait, this is separate. This is a different thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I think this is dandelion. Here are my potatoes, getting a little fresh air, and my shallot bulbs and garlic bulbs, and daikon radish and regular radish, and these came from the garden. And my plants came. I think that's probably three trees. Well, I, I opened the end that was up. And this was upside down. Oh, brother. Is that what's considered a tree? One little stick? Oh, my. What have I done? I see the heavier plant was in the bottom. I should do this with one hand. Okay. Wow. That's a little bent. Come on. My goodness. Earth. It's very bent. Okay. Okay, what is this? Oh, this is elderberry. Okay. It doesn't have to have a perfectly straight stem. Okay, what else is in here? Okay, that's the plum. There's supposed to be two of those. Two plums, there you go. Methley plum, blue damson and methley. 
And then it looks like I have three elderberry. I hope that's not broken. And it's supposed to have two pawpaw. I don't know. This one and this one. And I don't know what those are. Pawpaw. And just pear. And pear. Okay, I got two pear, two plums, three elderberries, and it looks like a one pawpaw. I thought I got two, but maybe not. And three of those, whatever they are. And I got 100 crowns. Doesn't look like much, but supposedly there's 100 asparagus crowns in there. Justin, I have a raincoat. But you don't <laughs> you don't have to work in the rain if you don't want. Huh? You don't have to work in the rain unless you want to. Um, I'm going to go a little bit farther. Stop busting all my tools again. Okay. Um, but look how awesome. These five are awesome. <laughs> wow. And by the way, this is not even the top layer level. I have the cedar, which is going to be the top row of this wood. So it'll be eight inches higher. I've got little mushrooms coming up in my seed trays. That's what I saw the other day. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. One thing that's really disappointed me is cilantro. Can hardly get that going. It grew like wildfire in my California garden. This is peppercress. I've never grown that before. Looks kind of interesting. Let's check up here. These look good. That's more pepper crust, but it's, I think it's getting too close to the light. It's getting a little, I need to move that. Oh, here's more. Lettuce looks awesome. Look at that. This is like a romaine. This is mescaline. These little things are growing everywhere. Tell me if that's bad, guys. I mean, we're always talking about mycelium and fungal activity being good. I took the lids off to let them dry out a little and I've got the fan going over there. Just gently enough to move the leaves and strengthen those stems. They would certainly be moving if they were out in the garden. Okay, let's get some breakfast.